Hello, my name is Mike Rayner and I'm with eWrench.com. This video is about how to set up a wireless connection in Windows 2 Server 2008 R2 for Virtual Machine. Normally, uh, Windows Server 2008 does not allow the virtual machines to uh, run off the wireless connection. The outcome for this video is to create a virtual network for your wireless connection and then set up Internet Connection Sharing ICS and bind it to a virtual network. And then finally verify the operation running of two simultaneous Ubuntu virtual desktops to make sure that everything's working. Requirements, laptop or desktop running Windows Server 2008 R2, Hyper-V installed, uh, wireless network interface card NIC, um, and an internet connection. Additional info, uh, we've got the Virtual PC Guy blog, and there's a guy by the name of John Paul Cook. He's got a good blog on uh, article on using wireless with Hyper-V. The first step in getting virtual machines to connect to the internet is create a virtual network for the virtual machines to connect to. So in this case we go to the virtual network manager and we're going to select internal add and we're going to make sure that we're going to give it a name ICS, ICS Wireless. And this is uh, internal virtual network that connects to the wireless adapter. Okay. So now make sure this internal is checked. And then we click OK or Apply. Goes through trundles for a while, applies changes. The next thing we're going to do is hook two machines to this virtual network that we just created. So we go to Settings. And this machine right here does not have a network connection. So we're going to go to Add Hardware. And we're going to click Network Adapter and Add. And we're going to pick ICS Wireless. And that's all there is to it. Click OK. Now, if you have another network connector, you, you might want to disconnect it. Then I always like to verify that I only have one network connector or, you know, exactly what it's supposed to be right here. Because I've seen this sometimes with... Uh, these network connections, it can get confusing. So I click OK. I verified that. And then Dev Ubuntu 02. I'm going to go to the settings on that. Click the network adapter for this one. Add. And then ICS Wireless is a name. Click OK. And then I'm going to go verify that again. Okay, so ICS Wireless, okay. Okay, our next step is to set up internet connection sharing. So we'll go to the Start Network Network and Sharing Center Change Adapter Settings. Now, when we going to be working with the wireless network connection we want to look right here it says local area connection 3 but it is ICS wireless this is the one that we're going to be connecting and making the internet connection sharing with local area connection 3 identified as virtual network ICS wireless so we go right here to wireless network connection right click properties click on sharing allow other network users to connect through this computer's network. And then local area connection 3, which is one that says ICS wireless. And then we go to our settings. And FTP server, internet, you can set however one, yeah, you want on these. And just simply click, you know, check and click OK. And then click OK. To make sure that everything binds, I prefer to restart 
uh, Windows Server 2008. And I'll close this. And we'll do a restart. And when we come back, we're going to check and, and make sure that everything uh, works. Here we've restarted uh, the server, Windows 2008 R2 server, and we're going to check our ICS connections. Uh, we're going to start, uh, here we are in Hyper-V Manager, and we're going to start a couple of virtual machines. Action, start, and let's start another one here. Action, start. So now we've got two virtual machines started. I still don't have the screen settings right for Hyper-V in Ubuntu, but that's something that I'll work on at some other time. Okay, here's one. Get this one started. Well, that one's go, actually, right here it is. We've already got a terminal down here. Uh, just click on this, open up a terminal, do an IF config, and you'll know it's got an internet address of 168.137.127.192. It's an internal address. And let's go take a look at the other one. Let's log into the other one. And this one, we're going to have to actually, because it's a different one, different virtual machine, we're going to have to go to search and actually do a terminal. It doesn't have a terminal lock to the uh, launcher. So we're going to do an IF config here, and this is 192.168.137.92. You notice that this one was 127, and this one's 0.92. So that they are they are getting two different IP addresses here. So verify that, and then we'll go. Let's uh, open up a browser, check our internet connection, and there's that. That's my YouTube channel, and we'll open up a browser on this one also exactly where this one goes to. It says, well, this is embarrassing. Bring this over here a little bit. And we'll go to uh, google.com just to show that this is... And we'll search for uh, ICS sharing just to show you that this is both so that they're both working so anyway that's how to uh get your virtual machines to connect uh through uh hypervisor and windows 2008 r2